Okay, so we just received our first donation of pallets. I almost forgot what she called them. And what we're doing is we're going to use these two pallets as is to make an L-shaped countertop for the kitchen of our tiny cabin. And that pallet over there is solid oak. Uh, we're going to repurpose the wood and uh, create a very country, rustic looking countertop. Uh, the spaces in between, we're thinking about um, putting rice paper behind so we can put lights on the inside of the countertop and have it shine through, give it kind of a rustic yet modern look. Uh, just a quick little video update of what's going on. Okay, and he's about to saw through these to repurpose the wood. Oh wow. Yep. That's why I said we'll just cut them out and piece it together. Oh, well, Charles has come up with an easier solution here than trying to hammer them out. We were running into problems with the wood trying to bust. I think this is going to re look really awesome, babe. Say hi to YouTube. Hi. Just in case we ever get famous. <laughs> it's not for this. You never know. People like men with saws. Everybody go to St. Louis Art for Autism .com. There's Princess in the window. I'm going to zoom in on her. And we are recording again. <laughs> I don't want to be on the phone if I lose a finger. You won't lose a finger. Knock on wood. Hi, princess. Hi. Say hi to the camera. Can you say I love you? Can you say I love you? Love you. Ow. Say I love you. Hey guys, I'm just doing a quick little video update of what we've got done so far. Uh, we've got the kitchen countertops installed. It's from the repurposed wood pallets that we got given to us for free. We've stained them and put a coat of polyurethane on them, uh, but we're going to put some extra polyurethane on it next time. Uh, it's almost completely finished. we got to just put some trim around the countertops and we'll be set. I think it looks pretty awesome. Um, the chimney there, that's going to be going outside or back to our house, whichever. Uh, we're picking up a Dickerson wood-burning stove unit that hangs on a wall. Uh, they make them for ships, so they're pretty small, but they heat up a huge space, and you can burn um, lots of materials in them. Uh, we got the floors completely done. Countertops done. Lights. We're going to be mounting up the solar panels um, on a roof here in a minute. Didn't do it last time because we had a bit of a wasp issue, got chased out a little early. Uh, but we got everything sealed up now, so we've had zero wasps in here. None. Uh, which is pretty awesome. I'm up here in the loft, if you can see. 
it's eventually going to be windows back here. So you can see right out into the night sky, look up at the stars while you're sleeping. Pretty cool. Uh, we're going to extend the loft out about a foot, foot and a half. Uh, that way we can actually put the bed long ways, have a lot more space, and there would be space in the sides for storage. Also, that's insulation. Um, that is for weathering purposes and also to keep any critters outside. Uh, that would be all covered up. You won't be able to see any of that. Alright, so that is my quick little video update. Thank you guys for watching.